dudes what's up we're back we're going to the grand old New York City New York New York I don't know what we're gonna do actually we're just going to New York City we have a delivery special delivery <laughs> can't tell you guys what it is but, um, it's not drugs or any paraphernalia <laughs> then we're just gonna explore and do what um do what we do best by the way this is my best friend Mike What's up, guys? What's up? I'm drinking some uh, celery juice. Uh, How's it staying healthy? <laughs> we're, on, on that vegan. <laughs> we're on the vegan grind. We're both vegan now. <laughs> okay, Mike's not vegan, but I am. I promised you guys on the vlog last week that I was going to become vegan. So um, this week I become vegan. Today's Monday, the first day of veganism. What's today's date? July. Um, July 20, 20 today. Um, <laughs> I, I become a vegan. Some people wonder what vegan life is like. It's interesting. I mean, I'm about 15 minutes in. Um, no, I'm just kidding. I did it for like seven months a year ago. <laughs> but um, no, I'm ready to feel a lot healthier. I'm ready to not have that stomach rot of fried food and meat inside of me. That stomach rot that you have right now because you chugged a Red Bull when you woke up this morning. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm 15. Actually, actually, Red Bull is vegan. Big Costco guy? Yeah. Costco guy? Yeah. Gotta support, gotta support bulk. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Do you have to have like a card to do this gas? No. Nah. Just debit. They don't take, they don't, they don't take cash though. <laughs> they don't take cash? No. Nah. Wait, so you don't have to have like a Costco card to get Costco gas? Nope. Selected debit and credit cards only. No cash accepted. <laughs> what about visas? Uh, like cool visas? I believe that's selected. Because uh, okay. I just used a visa. <laughs> so, I think there's no better time to take you through Mike's life and I'll break it down for you. <laughs> Mike was a young star from an early age, and then he became a sneakerhead. It has all been downhill ever since. He was a big Jordan Ugg guy, if that's a real thing. You know, Supreme SBs, they were huge. I mean, he like never listened to rap or anything, but huge sneaker sneakerhead. Huge sneaker. I mean, this kid had every shoe in the business. <laughs> he still got some shoes in his closet. I mean, we're gonna have to check it out later. All right. So after he became a sneakerhead, he went to Petty, the amazing institutional high school where we we met, and he became a prep school guy kid who wore Gucci slippers. No, what are they? Gucci uh, loafers and pinstripe. No. Uh, seersucker. seersucker shorts and seersucker tops and um, pink and actually I wore that too in high school um, <laughs> and now we're content creators and we really don't care about what we wear so I wear like all black now and he wears like hippie shit. so um yeah we love fish and the Grateful Dead and stay tuned we'll see you later go to get bagels <laughs> <laughs> A little bit of ice, because if the ice melts, then it just gets watered down anyways, and the ice is gonna melt because it's 95 degrees outside. Actually, it's 82 today. Whatever, it feels like 95. <laughs> Pretty excited to go to New York. The Big Apple. I haven't been here in a long time. I haven't been here since like 47 to 12 hours ago. <laughs> We're going to New York. Well, we're gonna take the train. That's the best part about living close to the city. We could just take the train in. But um, yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> Yo, dudes, what's up? We made the train. It, it barely, we were running. New York. Yo dudes, what's up? We're back here in New York. Um, we're about to go make the delivery. That train ride kind of sucked. We were on the quiet train. <laughs> we're not very quiet people, so that didn't work out very well, but um, it's gonna be a good day. Veganisms. Just exploring the New York cities. Excellent vegan choices. I mean, 
Juice Press. Not a sponsor, but um, should be. Yo, dudes, what's up? We are um, finishing up our juice here and about to go into the old Met Museum. We're going to see penises <laughs> and paintings. It's and a camp. Camp. That's a fashion for those of you who don't know. Uh, we were at the Met Gala, no big deal, uh, vlogging it. Right here on the stage. Right here. Like, literally, there was like a red carpet. We were there. I mean, roll the clip. Yeah. Oh, we don't have a clip. Um, <laughs> but uh, we'll see you on the other side. Yo dudes, all right, we're out of the uh, Met Museum. They didn't let me bring my juice in, so I got another one. And um, now we're gonna go to Columbia University. I'm gonna do something really stupid, but really smart at the same time. And you guys are gonna come along for the ride. Taxiing to the Columbia University where I um, attend school. <laughs> I'm an honor student. Um, big Columbia University guy, go Lions. Yeah, we're better than Princeton, Harvard, Yale, uh, that's, Brown. That's actually very true. I know, it's very true. I mean, we go to the city. We're city kids just doing city things <laughs> at Columbia. We go to the city. We go to the city to go to school. Um, uh, yeah. See you guys there. <laughs> Yeah, guys, this is um, where I go to school. Um, really nice campus. Beautiful. That was the library you were looking at. I study there probably 28, 34, 5, 50 hours a week. I mean, you, you have to study here at the Columbia University. It's not an Ivy League school for no like no reason. You, you got to study. There's no other options. Uh, probably going to go to law school here right after I finish up my English degree. But um, now we're going to head uptown to uh, downtown. downtown. No dude, dude, no. Just finished up at Flight Club. I didn't get anything because you know I wear the same pair of shoes every day. But Mike got some heat. He only spent twenty-two thousand dollars. <laughs> I mean, that's really nothing compared to some of the people on Complex. So I think we've made out pretty well. We've decided to just head home. It's too hot. We're gonna get food there. It was great. I, uh, you know, anytime I get to make a special delivery in the city and see some friends and uh, look at some art, it's a good day. And you know, I needed some retail therapy, so I did that too. And uh, you probably can't hear me right now because this wonderful air conditioner is just like, what is it like? Just like throwing cold air at me. But other than that, we're just chilling here in Penn Station. I'm exhausted. Just gonna go ahead and sign this one off because we're back in New Jersey. I'm exhausted, hungry, and a little bit like a toddler. Um, make sure that you like and subscribe this video in my channel, and I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Take it easy.